Yo, what's up, guys? It could be bringing to you another commentary. You're gonna be watching some ranked play on Biolab Hardpoint. Uh, this is ranked play. I haven't been playing it much lately. I think it may be a new season. I'm not too sure. I'm not really updated on all this. So, yeah, I just wanted to give you something competitive uh, to watch. Uh, I have sort of some other games saved that I'm gonna bring, bring into you. And I'm just going to be talking about sensitivity mainly and what, what's what been happening with me and my up, uh, uploading. So, as we'll start with uploading. So, my uploading, it was originally, as I said, it was a Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and occasionally I'll, I would do Friday, I said. And what really happened to that was that, so, my video that I was supposed to upload on Thursday, it was cutting, not cutting out, it was, there was just something wrong with it, as the audio sound was like a bit behind uh, the actual gameplay, so I didn't really want to upload that. Ooh, nice three piece, low key, oh, the four piece, nah. Uh, but yeah, uh, so that wouldn't upload, and then I said I was going to upload, I have a really sick clip that I or a sick, um, sort of game that I wanted to analyze for you guys, but I didn't have time to do that because I was not home yesterday so at my computer, so I couldn't do any of that. So I'm really hoping to get that fixed out. With, um, so I'm trying to get that done. That will probably, that should, I quote me on this, it will be done by Tuesday. I promise you guys it will be done by Tuesday. But, ooh, purple two-piece? Aw, oh, nah. But yeah. So that's that. That will that will definitely get fixed at some point, or not at some point. That will definitely get fixed tomorrow. So that's that. Now my main topic is uh, sensitivity. Sensitivity is really important in uh, in this game. I would say almost more than other games because there's so much movement in this game. So you have to be using the right sensitivity. As you, there's gonna be, there's a lot more of movement, so it's harder to hit your shots. I guess you could say. So. I, what I would recommend is, if you're trying to play, this is for competitive or pubs, just don't use 20 sensitivity, please, like, that does nothing for you, honestly. I don't know why people even do use 20 sensitivity, it's just a detriment, to be honest, like, I would say the highest sensitivity, the sensitivities you guys would want to go with, is you guys should use a 3 to 7, that is, that's a good sensitivity rock. Definitely. Um, I mean, it, it depends on your role mainly, to be honest. Like, if you're an AR, you're gonna want to run a two, like a lower sensitivity, like a two or a three, maybe a four. If you have a good shot, I guess you could say. But you don't want to be rocking like uh, 20 sensitivity if you're an AR and your shot's gonna be really shaky. So, and then if you're a sub, you're gonna want a little higher sensitivity, like a four. So for me. I used to use a really high sensitivity in Ghost. I think I played on uh, like an 8 or 9. Somebody told me that I should switch my sensitivity. So it was like, I didn't really believe them at first and everything. But so I, I decided. Oh, no bolt rag. But okay. So I decided to switch my sensitivity. And it took a while for me to get used to. But I slowly did it. I just played a lot, to be honest. Used to my new sensitivity. And. From there on, I just got used to it, and it, it was really, it's really so beneficial and helpful now that I think about it. Uh, so I'm playing right now on a Ford sensitivity. I don't know what, press pause. But yeah, I'm, I'm playing a Ford sensitivity. I'm a SMG Slayer, so it's, it's, it's a fine sensitivity. I would say a lot of, most players play on either, uh, three, four. That's what most players play on in this game. So, I would definitely recommend you do that. If you're in AR, maybe... I would try 3 if you're in AR. And the best way to just get used to it is just... Just kill a lot of things, honestly. You can go into a private match and go against bots and just keep on... And just kill it, uh, kill bots until you feel like your shot is good with that new sensitivity you're using. So, yeah. Also, something else that um enhances your aim and, and um, sensitivity plates to sensitivity is control freaks which I uh, give a quick quick talk about in my warming up video which I'm gonna sort of do more in-depth analysis right now so control freaks they're basically 
uh, they're little extensions on your analog sticks, so they make them a little bit higher, and what they're supposed to do is, or what they do do, in fact, is, one sec, yeah, sorry, my game sound was just really high, um, they're supposed to make it so you move your st uh, stick less, which then this, it correlates to your aim being better because you have to move it less so you don't have to move it as far as your opponent and it also what it does is it allows you it's supposed to allow you to play on a higher sensitivity but keep that shot still good um like keep that shot as good as somebody with a lower sensitivity like you could be playing on a five sensitivity but you could because of that uh, the control freak it would move sl you would move uh you could be able to move it as i guess slightly the analog stick as slightly as somebody with like three sensitivity so it really does help out i do have a pair right now of control freaks you can go look at them control freak does like they have like tons of different ones ones for fps and ones just for uh other games in general that's all basically and they have comparisons of them like different ones have like different like patterns on them and all different kinds of things like different heights and all that so those do have some effect on like what they do and how they do it but you guys should just my opinion would be just the website's called control freak i'll, I'll probably put a print link in the description for it so you should just go check it out just you can read up on them they're really cheap too um i think they're only like ten dollars ten fifteen dollars and they really do ho help your shot so much i remember how much my shot improves in ghost when i switch to control freaks but yeah that's basically that to be honest uh you guys you can also if you go on twitter you can find pros have a lot of people actually have discount codes like five percent ten percent so you can probably get like maybe like a not a, maybe a dollar off i don't know maybe like half a dollar but i guess it all helps sort of so yeah definitely should check those out i would highly recommend that you check those out and the main thing well i'll just tell you which ones i have right now i have the ultra ones i think they're i like the higher ones i think they're the second highest control freaks that you can buy i just sort of bought them because uh, i have the I had the ghost ones. I had the same ones on the 360 from Ghost, so I decided to um, get those. But yeah, that's got that. That's the guys clutching up in the ranked play again. That win. Okay, look. Yeah, will be a new season because I am at the Browns division. But yeah, that's it, guys. And it's Kobia. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, follow me on Twitter. And I'm out.